Terrell crews are searching right now for the missing sailor as we speak. Meanwhile, we just heard from Seamus Gray's mother. She's understandably very upset, shaken up, and worried sick about where her son could be. Now, he was last seen leaving a bar early Saturday morning, but concerning video shared with ABC7 shows what happened outside the bar moments before he went missing. Now, this morning, crews were seen searching the area near the lake in Waukegan. His mother came here from Florida. She's joining police who are combing the area right now. Also this morning, an attorney for Ibiza nightclub, the bar Gray was last spotted at, shared this surveillance video exclusively with us. Gray seen here wearing red. He says Gray first left Ibiza at 10.30 p.m. Then, according to the attorney, returned to the bar at 1.30 a.m. near closing time. The attorney says the bar kicked Gray and a group of others out shortly after because they were too intoxicated. At one point in the video, Gray is seen laying on the ground. Now, minutes later, in another surveillance video shared by Waukegan police, captures Gray walking alone at the intersection of Sheridan Road and Washington around 1.40 a.m. Police say subsequent videos show him walking toward the lake. Gray did not report back to the Naval Station Great Lakes at his assigned time, leading to an extensive search over the past several days. I'd like for anybody who has any information about my son Seamus to please come forward and please help me. That's my boy. That's my guy. His little brother is 14 and it is my son's role model. He's my, he's, he's my life. So, so please help find Seamus. Waukegan police have been searching the nearby area, including the metro station here, the lakefront, and they say they will be searching the lake itself very soon. They're putting all their efforts in to finding this missing sailor.